This is the Remote Work Life Business Spotlight, where I highlight top remote business innovators and share personal and career development tips to help you navigate the world of remote work. I'm your host, Alex Wilson Campbell. I help remote work managers, professionals, and freelancers overcome isolation and uncertainty in their life to get hired and fulfill their career goals. Hey, this is a very quick overview of taxjar.com. Taxjar is a 100% remote business. Based in the USA, they hire US citizens only. Um, I thought it'd be useful just to give you this overview so you're at least aware of um, some of the businesses that you could potentially approach. Um, either if they're hiring or if you want to provide services to them. But taxjar.com is where you should look. They were established, I, when I'm doing research, I usually flip between the, the actual website and, and LinkedIn. And Taxjar happens to have a very good LinkedIn profile. So Taxjar, they were established, let's have a look, in 2013, as it says there. Um, They serve the accounting industry, as it says there, and their specialities are sales tax, e-commerce, accounting, and API. It's very much a technology company which which services that particular industry. Um, and what they say on their website specifically about what they do, if you again flip across to their about page, which is right at the bottom, and again, in your own time, if you look at taxjar.com, you can have a look in more detail, but taxjar is a leading technology solution um, for busy e-commerce sellers to manage sales tax. So essentially, that's the main problem that they help to solve is, you know, who, who likes to deal with tax? So taxjar is one of those um, solution providers that help to deal with tax. As I said before, established in 2013, they're pretty well established and they've got 15,000, uh, they've been trusted by 15,000 businesses. So this, you, you can assume from this, that this is a, a reputable business, highly reputable business to work for. Another area to look at as part of your research is obviously the people and try to get an understanding of the, of the culture and what they're about. And Taxjar, again, has got a great area of their website here. This just gives a, an overview, of sort of an info graphic of their, the spread of people across the USA. And if you scroll down here, you can see some of the key personnel, Mark Fagiano being the, the CEO. Definitely have a look at his profile if you're looking to, to approach Taxjar. And again, you can click through to his LinkedIn profile, which is really handy. And Again, through looking at this great section that they put together, you can understand the sorts of people that they've hired in the past and where you might fit into that whole um, that whole scheme of things. So technology, revenue, data, um, sales, engineering, customer success, marketing. Do any look at their profiles on LinkedIn and see if any of their skills are aligned with yours? any of their interests are aligned with your interests. Again, that the culture thing, the culture is a lot more difficult to find and a lot more difficult to understand because business is right about their culture, but until you actually get there, you probably won't get a complete feel, but it can give you a tax jar has done a good job of actually just trying to give an overview of their culture. And they've provided videos on their website as well. There's a video somewhere, I think it's in the about section. I'm not As I said, I'm not, not going to go too deeply into this, but if you go to the job section, you can get an idea of their mission here and who they are here. But again, look at the videos that are online about TaxJar 2. And once you start to engage, you'll get, as I said, a bit more of a feel for um, a feel for who, the, what they are, what they're about. I don't know if they're, well, they are hiring at the moment. There is a section view open positions here. I mean, you, if you're watching this video in the future, obviously this is going to change, but Again, this could give you the idea of the sorts of positions that they hire for. So product engineering, marketing, plus, which includes account management and customer success. So have a look at taxjar.com and get a feel of what they're doing, what they're about. LinkedIn, as I said, is another great place to look. I think they've got a really, really good LinkedIn page. They're sharing news quite regularly one of their latest pieces of news which was shared about two weeks ago is that they have um they shared a piece of news from insight venture partners or about their actual funding round from insight venture partners of 60 million dollars so 
you can see that this is a business that's really investing and really looking to to ramp things up. They've grown quite quickly. So have a look at taxjar.com. Um, if uh, Darcy Bowles is anything to go by, this is this is a great business uh, to to work for with some great people. So definitely recommend having a look. That's it for today's episode of the Remote Work Life podcast. Click the link in the show notes below to access a free list of 100 remote businesses that hire regularly. And if you're feeling stuck or uncertain on issues of career or personal development, head on over to www.remoteworklife.io where you can watch exclusive on-demand video featuring real-world remote work leaders and future of work experts on key remote work topics, including how to get clarity on your career direction, how to thrive while working remotely, how to network effectively and stay connected, and how to tend to your personal and career development needs. Go to remoteworklife.io now and remember to connect with me, your host, Alex Wilson-Campbell, on YouTube, LinkedIn, and Facebook.